Chuck Ruthers here at CES 2011, and we want to talk about laundry right now. Do you know how to do your laundry? Your machine might. I'm here with Brett from Maytag, who has a couple of machines here that have screens on here that will tell us how to do our laundry. Absolutely. The nice thing about this is the new Maytag Maximal pair that will be coming out in April. And this particular pair, as you so eloquently put, has an LCD screen on it. And most people would think, well, is this just about doing my laundry and setting the water temperature? Mm -hmm. Well, it does, but it does a whole lot more. That's how we're taking technology and converging it into an appliance that people use every day. So for instance, if you go into the learn more, I want to learn more about what I can do with my laundry. You can learn about the cycle, or there's other categories that you can learn about. So we can learn about washer cycles, how to adjust cycles, but probably the one consumers will use most is the stain solutions. Yes. So let's select that. Now, I have a, a nine-year-old and a 12-year-old, and you know, when they were growing up, we had some instances of, of some spills, some baby food. So let's talk about the children. Yes. Well, we have baby food, we have baby formula, and of course the, the dreaded baby, baby poop. poop. Yes. Yeah, you want to be able to get that out on the first shot, I think. Yep, and you know, what's nice about this, we talked about technology converging into this washing machine. The Maytag Maxima does have the power wash cycle that gives you industry best cleaning performance. But it doesn't just stop there. We know that consumers, when they use their washing machine, they want to know that it's going to work for them and they don't have to think about a lot of interacting with it. So one of the pieces that we've done with this is we actually have a, a, an optimal dose dispensing system that you see here. This dispensing system allows you to load detergent here and based upon your detergent concentration, it will hold 12 loads of laundry detergent, 18 loads of detergent, or if you use 6X detergent, all the way up to 36 so loads I can load of half a bottle in here, you're saying? Well, almost. So if I do that with my current washing machine, I'll just get end up with a mess. That's right. So convince this... my wife that this is a good idea. <laughs> How does it work that you can put all of that in there at once? Abs so what you do is you fill that up to the max fill line, mm -hmm. and then um, you set the detergent concentration and the water hardness of the water in your home. Once you do that, the rest of it is all done by the washing machine. Okay. It senses the size of the load, whether you have a large load or a small load. It senses the soil level that you have in there. It, senses, it looks at the cycle, takes all of that into account, and what it does is once it does that, right there, it dispenses the right amount of detergent into the washer. Now how it does that is we also have an industry exclusive power spray nozzle inside this washing machine so that it sprays water and detergent directly onto the load for better cleaning performance. There we go. So we have this obviously in the washer. We have uh, the screen as well in the dryer. Absolutely. In the dryer, you have the screen and again, many of the same features. And this also has hints and tips, a before you call section. So really it does provide the ultimate solution for you and the consumer whenever they need to, to use it. There we go. So when are these uh, going to be available to the public? Yes. These will be available in April of 2011, um, and they'll be available in the crimson color that you see, in white, and also a granite, which is a type of graphite color. There we go. Well, one other quick question. Yes. Obviously, we've got water in here and heat in here, yes. and we've got sensitive electronics. What, what have you done to this to make sure that these things, which these are typically two of the enemies of electronics, what have you done to make sure that these aren't going to be affected? That's a great question. Um, what we've done is we've had years and years of using electronics in many of our different appliances as well. Cooking, refrigeration, dishwashers. We've taken that technology mm -hmm. and we've put coatings and protection on the back side of these to keep them um, for, so that they don't experience any of the, the water that you were talking mm -hmm. about in the washer and preventing any heat getting to them in the dryer. There you go. Thank you so much, Brad. For more information on these, don't forget to check out the show notes for this segment at butterscotch.com.